three spacing stallions and geldings are pretty to the post racing one mile purse one thousand eight hundred dollars feel of eight there are no changes ten minutes until post time number one dinkers fling owned by robert dinkelman of stowe ohio luster teeters trains and drives the two long gone destiny Oh, by Henry of Mount Sterling and Stidham of Circaville, Jerry Kuchbach, the trainer for Dave Miller. Number three, Scoot Newton, oh, by Lloyd Voiles of Michigan, Todd Christie of Florida, Todd Christie trains, Dan Ader drives. Four guns and knives, owned by B and Kenny Edwards of Delaware, Kenny Edwards trains, Mike Wilder up. Five street rags owned by Kevin Manley of Beaver Creek and Ron Newton of Clarksville. Kevin Manley trains for Dell Miller. Number six, Mr. L. Owned and trained by Mark Clark of Springfield for David Myers. Seven artists in Hanover owned by Rebecca Green, Dorothy Parker, and Glenda Green of Ohio. Gary Green trains. Jeff Fouch with the lines. And from post eight, Sir Mix-a-Lot, shown by Cougar and Schultz. John Schultz trains Eric Lentford in the sulky win play show perfecta and a trifecta wagering nine minutes. Sixth race, pacing stallions and gildings, lining up, moving in. There they go. They're off and uh, pacing long gone destiny from the inside first for the late Mr. L is sent from the outside Dinkers fling from off the pylon showing some early pace third three wide and fourth as artisan Hanover at the bit and fifth Scoot and Newton dropping into sixth comes guns and knives two lengths seventh street rags early trail of eighth is Sir Mixalot around the first turn and Mr. L looking to Take the lead and now does. Takes the lead here. Long gone destiny to the inside. A big hold and to the outside. Here comes Artisan Hanover. He's been parked every step of the mile. Opening quarter 28 and 3. And the 8 to 1 shot. Artisan Hanover now takes command. Mr. L of the inside is racing his second. Long gone destiny remains at the real third. Dinkers fling his fourth. Five to Scoot and Newton to the inside and racing his sixth guns and knives. Three length seventh to Street Rags into the inside eighth, Sir Mixalot. The half 58 and three as they make the turn to the back stretch. Artisan Hanover controlling the pace here by two. And now to the outside comes Scootin Newton. And Scootin Newton moving briskly, moving up alongside the leader and pressuring the pace. Mr. L is now locked in third at the rail. Guns and Knives getting a perfect trip here. He's second over fourth. Long gone destiny remains fifth on the inside and Dinkers fling a long shot 23 to 1 to the outside is sixth around the three quarters 128 and 4. Around the final turn in Artisan Hanover the inside looking for the upset but on the outside as Scoot Newton is right there poised to strike and take the lead. Mr. L is looking for racing room and to the outside uh, guns and knives now less than an eighth and down the stretch they come Scoot Newton puts a neck in front and Scoot Newton drawing clear. Between horses, long gone destiny coming through late, but it's Scoot and Newton getting up late here. Scoot and Newton by three. Long gone destiny was second. The mile at 158 and two. Here's the official winner of the sixth race, number three, Scoot Newton. From the first crop of Tudor Scooter, from the oil burner mare, Peachy Nuke, owned by Lloyd Boyles and Todd Christie. Todd Christie trains Dan Ader in the Sonky. First win of the season, earning a mark here tonight, one, 58 and a two fair. Sixth race.